I want to talk a little bit here about this woman. Um, her name is uh, Mama Malyun. Um, she is of the Darod clan. Uh, I think her sub clan is the Majarten. She's from uh, Puntland, Bari, uh, and she lives in Minnesota. In here, she's um, doing uh, her their actually clan uh, ceremonies about these parasites. And in here, she's communing uh, with the uh, Middle Eastern parasites uh, called Wadaddu. Wadaddu, uh, mean, it means priests. And so she's talking about what these Middle Eastern parasites are and how they infect people. And uh, as you can see in here, she's actually doing the ceremonies, what they call the, um, uh, what it it's some kind of a it is some kind of an exorcism ceremony where they actually try to um, alleviate the pain that these parasites actually induce or they try to talk to these parasites to try to actually release their stronghold and so in order to actually um, incite them or entice them to actually release the the, the stronghold on they have on the person they do all kinds of offerings they give them all kinds of offerings and in here these particular parasites uh, she says uh, love uh, the, the the offerings that she has in there uh, it's mainly she says of uh, it's composed of dates of uh, was popcorn coffee tea and the most important thing, the most important things are the perfumes. These are Middle Eastern musk, musks, or perfumes, or some kind of a. So it's some kind of a Middle Eastern fucking scent that you have to put on yourself for this motherfucker to actually smell and probably recognize the scent like a, some kind of a fucking dog and then basically uh, calm down or some shit and so she puts on the musk she's like some kind of a she's like it's called the pink musk or something and she actually uh basically uh puts on the musk she some she actually um uh, basically uh uh i think she actually I don't know which one she actually is. There's a small one and there's a tall one. She actually uh, puts on uh, both of them, I, I, I think. And then she actually uh, mumbles some kind of uh, uh, incantations where she actually sending these parasites to anybody actually who actually wronged her. I kid you not. And so she talks about these parasites being some of the, the most oldest uh, of the parasites. I, that's what she says. Uh, she says some sheikhs say that these parasites can turn into mingis, there, which is some, it's some other demons they actually also worship or try to actually spread. The that's the mammy demon, the you know the. Uh, so in any case, she's saying these parasites don't turn into the mingis ones. She says these. Uh, Wadado parasites are ancient. Uh, they they were with her uh, grand uh, the grandmother. Her grandmother used to have them. I don't know where she brought them, but I guarantee you, hundred percent, these are some fucking Middle Eastern fucking parasite they brought from Yemen, especially from the the southern the Hadr al Mud, the place called the, the place of death. They brought these parasites from there. And she, she, she's like, her, her grandmother used to actually uh, carry them. She used to feed them. She used to actually use them. And uh, she used to actually talk to these parasites. And so basically, it's some kind of a uh, basic generational curse that they actually spread between themselves. And it goes down the, 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 the lineage. And she's like, the 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 priest is the with that right now the human ones we don't know if the humans these motherfuckers could be also hybrids they she says 
she says they, they don't want to acknowledge these parasites but she's like we carry these uh parasites like i said before these motherfuckers came in some of these motherfuckers came in from the middle east in 10 a.d and spread these parasites with islam and these parasites infected they use these parasites these genes or these shadowy entities smoke entities with red eyes to actually spread islam that's how they spread islam in the world and in here they basically spread these parasites in the basically in the locals in the the, the the nomadic people and then they created hybrids and so and then they spread islam and so they created these shakes and she's like they don't want to actually uh, acknowledge that these parasites are real they exist but she's like i'm gonna post this video online and then tell people these parasites are real and they actually are feeding on us and she's like i don't care who actually watches the video i don't care what they say about me i don't care she's i swear i kid you know that's what she says and while she's doing that she actually like cursing the people who actually uh don't don't want to acknowledge this shit. and she's like she's sending them she's like anybody who actually wronged me take this take that I, i'm sending these it's basically some kind of a witchcraft ceremony and i kid you know i talked about these things in every freaking u.s households they in they actually are spreading these parasites at some point she 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 takes the uh, the incense burner and then puts it outside and she's like uh, I'm, I'm sending this shit in the in the open it's like she's like go yeah she's like oh they want to be in the open they want to be something like that so don't get it twisted this might see this might look some kind of a local thing this is actually a macrocosm of what they actually these middle eastern arabs are doing in mecca it's no different don't think this is basically some kind of a a, a witchcraft that that's basically uh it's isolated no it's this is basically an image of what these motherfuckers are doing in the middle east or what they've been doing in the middle east for generations and this is what they spread and in here all she's doing is basically giving what giving giving these parasites what they want in order to actually get these parasites off your back for a while she's like okay every year we have to do this or, or you know we have to give these motherfuckers these things we have to actually talk to these motherfuckers and something something like that she's like so in order to actually remove temporarily these motherfuckers they have to do this kind of ceremonies and remember these are only one type of these middle eastern parasites these fuckers are many she's like at some point she's like yeah there's many of these motherfuckers there's the rohan there is the um uh, she, so, so she's actually giving them different names and so they mutate these motherfuckers according to the fucker with the hybrid scent or musk who actually creates these motherfuckers through some kind of a of 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 uh i don't know did they, they combine them it's like when you see these motherfuckers like there's i posted of some of these demons this um Hager, damn it this motherfucker is flying a snake he's got a cat or some kind of reptilian on his shoulder so these are different energies these middle eastern motherfucking warlocks combined they cook these motherfuckers in some kind of a space and then they basically send them sometimes they can create all kinds of monsters and these are different energies and so we don't know how many of these fuckers are in one big ball of energy or or if they're different but at some point she mentions different motherfuckers and she's like this motherfucker can't turn into this other motherfucker because this motherfucker is ancient and he's he's been with us or something like that so the point is they're spreading these middle eastern fucking parasites like it's nothing she puts the incense burner outside and i guarantee you is gonna go somewhere whatever the fuck incantation she, she's pulling it's gonna go somewhere and it's gonna affect the americans in that region and at some point if you watch what she's doing she's actually she, she puts the incense burner on her head like i talked about before it's called the, the dabqat it's raising the fire she's trying to do something on the crown chakra the crown chakra where i posted images where they actually uh infected the crown chakra there's i posted people with their crown chakra infected with these middle eastern fucking parasites they go in there 
and then they infected the crown chakra or the person at some point also she actually puts the incense burner on her left shoulder basically next to the heart again i talked about that as well where they in, they basically when they send these middle eastern fucking parasites they attach to the back of the heart that's the target you can say maybe they're going for the emf of the head and the basically heart but that's not that's not it they they target these two areas yes because they're feeding on maybe i don't know maybe they're feeding on the emf but they also feed they try to feed on these two locations the the crown chakra and the heart chakra because they seem to be important for these fuckers and the heart chakra is basically where they actually these freaking uh what is it some kind of a um you have to watch you have to listen to the americans there's an american in the middle eastern arabs the american i think he's a, he's a muslim who it's an american it's an african-american who becomes a muslim or something like that i'm going to post the video in here and so the arab the arab one is teaching this fucker how to actually call in these middle eastern parasites i kid you not and i think he's a muslim or maybe he became muslim and then what he does is he does the muslim prayer and he reads the chapter of the jinn and then he says these motherfucking parasite then comes on him they descend on him and they attach on his left shoulder the back of the heart and that motherfucker then spreads these parasites in new york i kid you not that's what he said and so the middle eastern arab is teaching these motherfuckers how to call in their middle eastern parasites and then spread them in new york i kid you not and so when the that motherfucker is going to spread them and then on every person that he infects these parasites are going to go on the back of the heart and then they, they will stay there and then they will feed until they receive a program from a middle eastern sheikh or somewhere else and at some point they will initiate the middle eastern programming to become a muslim they will they will feed on that person as long as they can feed in at some point that person is going to come in contact with another middle eastern who's got some energy from whatever the fuck this motherfucker bring them and if that motherfucker's energy is encoded with his middle eastern fucking incantation whatever the fuck it is and then he basically gets in contact with the other one and then he will infect the other one and that incantation will go into the other one and then at some point it will become that person will become a muslim i kid you not so this is how they spread these fucking parasites and so if you watch the video she puts the incense burner on her left shoulder to try to actually alleviate that motherfucker who's actually hiding on her basically heart or the, or the back of the heart and she never actually does the same thing on the on the right side because that motherfucker is not on the right side it's on the left side i talked about this and all these motherfucking zoomanis that you see online uh basically on these social media are spreading these parasites i'm not saying these things a lot of people know that these little fuckers are spreading these parasites they all infected they carry these fucking parasites like I said before, they are the most infected people on this planet. I've offered a thousand dollars to anyone who can post at least four videos of any other group of people on this planet who are stacked up in stadiums, shaking and get and who are infected at that level. No one ever has actually posted any videos. And so I'm telling anybody who's been in contact, who's been next to a Somalians to check yourself you are probably infected with these middle eastern parasites they actually are spreading